Alright. Hey guys, it's Andresa. I just wanted to come on really quick because I'm finally out and about doing this family dollar couponing rolling thingamajigger. And some things on my glasses drive me nuts, so bear with me really quick. Um, so yeah, I just went to my first family dollar. There's multiple family dollars in my area. And um, everything worked, I think, the way it was supposed to. Not exactly sure. I'll do a whole thing when I get home on exactly what I did in the transactions. But the reason why I'm coming on right now is because I wanted to kind of... I'm sure, like, everyone's been doing this now for, like, what, over a week? But... I noticed that a lot of the products that were on this deal, um, you know, buy the three and get five dollars um, back, or you know, you get your five dollars. I got a fifty cent. I don't. I'm. I. I don't know. But anyways, um, I did get a, a dollar one. I got a. I don't know. But anywho, that's not even the point of what I'm trying to say. What I'm trying to say is, you guys, be careful of the expiration dates on these products because I don't normally shop at Family Dollar. Um, this is the second time I have. The first time was when those nail polishes were rolling and then now. And um, thank goodness, like my daughter and I both thought to look at the expiration dates because the cereals that I had in my cart were literally gonna expire like in a month. And um, ah, I mean, I guess if, if you're fine with that, you're fine with that, but certain things cereal it's gonna taste old if ugh, I don't know I just won't do it and then some of the what do you call those the like taco the kit. oh the taco kits were already expired um, no wonder there were so many on the shelf um, yeah all the taco kits were um, expired already and so I didn't get any of those so this first transaction that I got um, I got some Capri Suns because I thought that they were going to be a bigger deal than they ended up being. Um, they were $2.50 each and I thought I was going to get $2 back leaving it $0.50, cents, but I didn't. I only got $0.50 cents back leaving it. I bought them for $2 each, which I that could be right, obviously. I thought it was different. But um, then I also got some of the gummies, what do you call them? The fruit chews the Spongebob and the Dora, um, and I got the Supreme Brownie Mix stuff, and, um, oh, a big old thing of the Kool-Aid stuff, um, Hawaiian Punch, Hawaiian Punch. um, I got that too, because I thought that that was supposed to be, I don't know, I don't know, I should have, I should have wrote down everything. And the ad on my phone is not showing me the actual ad ad. But anyways, the whole point of this is just to say, be careful of expiration dates on this stuff, guys. Because especially if you're buying a whole bunch to store, um, yeah, some of it's not going to store very well. Um, and some of it's already expired. So I don't know if it's just my store or if it's, you know, that's a typical thing at Family Dollar. I don't know. But just be careful of expiration dates, guys. Okay? Bye! They won't stop. Come on, stop.